Hello my friend, welcome to my channel. Today I've got F Essence Vibrant Purple and Color Clubs covered in diamonds. I started off with Neltix Formula 2 and here's the Essence the Gel and it's Vibrant Purple. Oh, it's just camera's not doing this one justice. Oh, and I'm going to cap my free edge first. And for those of you that wonder, I do this because when I lay down the first coat, it lays it out flat over that tip instead of leaving a lump. And I'm really enjoying doing my nails that way. At least for the color portion part of it. I'm still capping after with the top coats. But <laughs> for the color part, this is working out for me. Hi Woody, how you doing? And here we go with our second coat. I'm telling y'all, these Essence polishes are just amazing. Um, the formulas are really good, and the brush, I love it. I'm going to top it with some Pro FX Quick Dry Top Coat. Get it to dry down a little bit. There we go, got that one covered. If I can quit ninny in it and leave it alone. Hi Woody, back again. Now this next polish I'm gonna use is by Color Club and it's called Covered in Diamonds. And it's it's just like those foil or cellophane flaky looking. I just I don't know. I've had it forever. This is really an old polish in my collection. Um, you know, you just, I don't know if this is still out there or if you can find anything like it, but I had to break it out. So you kind of got to manipulate them a little bit, get them kind of spread around and everything. I'm going to top it with the Pro FX Quick Dry Top Coat again. And um, I just want those flakies to be kind of smoothed out before I stamp. I'll be using CAD's Fashion 008 and my Monocle Stamper and Brave Steva on the black. And my Clear Jelly Scraper. I didn't want to cover up all of my Manny with stamping and I know how carried away I get. So um, I decided to kind of use this like half moon shape up near the cuticle on most of my nails which I don't nail them all straight so it's but it's okay and I am gonna pick up this extra with tape I did okay on that one the pointer finger is just bad wonky but whatever just talk faster with your hands nobody will notice <laughs> and then this image down here just caught my eye. It's like a triangle or not a triangle, a diamond shaped image. It just caught my eye and I thought that one would look cute on my ring finger. Just a little something something. So there we go. Got all that bling going on. I'm going to top it with the Jealous by American Classics. It's a really thick top coat but it's not a fast dry thing so um, I use this to fill in glitters pixie dust um, textured polishes anything that's lumpy and bumpy and I want to smooth it out <laughs> it works really good for that and then I'm going to top it with the fast and hard by vibrant bottles I'm showing you guys how low I'm getting I'm having to really work that bottle to get the rest of it out really enjoyed that top coat a nice thick top coat and it smells good <laughs> it dries fast and it's shiny too so I might have to repurchase that one I haven't fallen out of love with posh I just you know like having options and Woody is back again so there we go so there you have it this manicure looked gorgeous out in the sunshine so there's my swatch photo. I hope you enjoyed this one. Leave me a comment down below. I want to thank you for watching. And until next time, be good to yourself.